so they'll be calling you a radical. Gonna hit you right on the jet stream from the other side. Who would ever believed it? Who would ever believed it? Who would it ever believed it? Say it ain't so, Joe. Say it ain't so, Joe. Say it ain't so. Who would ever believed it? Who would ever believed it? I don't know if any of you have been to the capital of Ukraine. Kiev. What a grand city. And I mean a grand city, as you know. In the wars to end all wars, as they call them, the patriotic wars in that part of the world. Well, Russia calls it that. Ukrainians don't call it that. World War One, World War Two. There'll be no monarchies, remember? No monarchs. That was the Atlantic Conference, which evolved the UN. How did the UN end up in Vienna? I thought it was going to be New York. Still man, still man, still man. Stalin. Who would have ever believed? Well, history repeats itself. Now, who's the Grand Duke, Supreme Commander? Who's the heir to that? And they still know it matters. Who's the heir to that? Is it Putin? No. It's Prince Harry. Now, how did the United States come to be? Let's have class, kitties. How did the United States come to be, kitties? How did they come to be? The Revolutionary War, kitties. Hanson, the first president? I don't know. Ask Prince. Nude descending down staircase. Dead purple nude found in elevator. Stan tuned. Freaking metaphors matter. Metaphors matter. Metaphors matter. It's Prince Harry. So we fought a revolutionary war. One by jet stream. Two by cable TV. World War Three by Japanese current. So gonna hit you right on the jet stream. So everything's good, except what, what, what? Just on the 26th of January, a group of rockfish was caught way out in the ocean, Pacific Ocean, it, it, left coast, right coast, just removes left to right, was caught with 1,400 becquerels of cesium-137. What, 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 what? Yeah. 14 times over the safe legal limits. Utah, Utah, <laughs> usury, United States, doesn't have it. Obama raised those limits. Now, this is a metaphor. As you know, the wells have collapsed. The Great Pacific Genocide is unarguable, documented by Kevin Blanche. The salmon, we don't catch dead tide pools. Kevin Blanche does. We don't catch dead humans in bone marrow transplant centers. Kevin Blanche does. I was almost one. It'll be 10 years down the stretch I come. Bob Bafford, freaking yay. <laughs> I bet on the local trainer from Kentucky. Can I get my money? Uh, Bafford got stripped. Well, where's the horse? Where's the evidence? Horse died. Shh. On Balco. On Balco. Bob Baffert now. It's Del Mar Syndrome. Argentina. Lance Armstrong writing. Excuse me. Mark McGuire. Swinging Albert Bell's bat. Riding Lance Armstrong's bike on the back of a Bob Baffert train horse. Ain't that America? Something to see. Little pink houses for you and me. Freaking... What a metaphor. Barack Obama, well watching on President's Day in Hawaii. What else do I have to say? You know, what else do I have to say? I mean, I named it Post Ignorance on 10, 10, 10. Where's your book? It's right here somewhere. And as I said in my book, there it is. I said, if we don't pivot now, it will swallow us whole. 10, 10, 10 as I stroke that key. Well, what a book. What a book. Oh, my God. For I see for miles and miles. Wow. What's that? Alice in Wonderland. Huh. What? You use that for a bookmark? So, good news is, Turkey Point in Florida, the NRC has reversed the 30-year extension licensing. The corruption of that head of the NRC, which, now think about this, the corruption that was in they reversed that decision. That head of the NRC that put that forward worked at Idaho National Lab. With who? Jose Reyes, the CEO of New Scale. What? Don't you think that's a little comment? Who approved the little SMR? <laughs> Kevin Blanche proves it all in the Utah State Legislature. I mean, the greatest fraud ever perpetrated in the history of the state of Utah. Right out of our light bill. You pay a light bill? In Utah, you've been freaking had. You've been defrauded hardcore. 
So, whoever believed tanks rolling through a major European city in our lifetime, the wars to end all wars. My uncle stood on D-Day, Omaha Beach, who was with the original United States group that got to the bunker where Hitler was. Harold Blanche looked him up. That's who raised me. My dad, who was nuked to death in the Nevada test site. My other uncle, who just passed away, probably the most decorated pilot in this country post, you know, World War II, who just passed away, buried at Arlington. Those are the men who raised me. Oh, they're rolling in their graves. My uncle used to say all the time, your generation, when our generation's gone, you'll forget. It'll happen again. I used to ask him all the time, well, when you got there, well, the Russians had already been there. You know, how many men did they lose? The price that Ukraine has paid, the Russian famine, World War One, Patriotic War, World War Two, Patriotic War, that's what Russia used to call them. There were no men left. Oh, Chernobyl. Plutonium Wars, who had believed it in our lifetime, he says, it'll just happen again. You'll forget. You'll forget. The devastation that was rained down on Europe. Vienna is so grand because he was Austrian, right? He didn't bomb out his own country. Krakow he left for some reason. The capital of Ukraine. Oh, that city is so grand. Tanks rolling in. Wow. Wow. Now that's a metaphor. Metaphors matter, Barack Obama. To everyone, hands up. No nukes. Hands up. No nukes. Stand tuned. We either pivot this 10 10 10 or it will swallow us whole. We didn't pivot and it swallowed us whole. It's the greatest coincidence in human history. Dead tie pulls at your feet, ED. It's a cult. Heat bubble in the Western United States. All everything. All this started in 2011. Play back the tape, Your Honor. That is if there is one. Joseph Google. I mean, Google. First Amendment. Patriot Act temporary. Remember when they invaded 2014? That's when Obama upped the ante in Ukraine. Meanwhile, back on the Russian ranch. Meanwhile, back on the United States ranch. It's the ecology, stupid. So they reversed it at Turkey Point. It's not all bad. The fight goes on. Gonna hit your ride on the jet stream from the other side. In 1997, there was an accident at Japan, a nuclear accident. What day did it happen? March 11th. You cannot make it up. <laughs> Stand tuned.